Let me take you back to the very beginning when God created man. Man, Ghana, woman, Asasi, earth, mother, womb, tomb, beginning, our span, the very end. Let me tell you of the day when Krong Krong Nananyangupong created man. He gave him the trees to shade him from the sun. He left him the vast plains where he could run. These and many more did Obadiah give his son. Now among man's neighbors were the lion and his ass. The dandelion in her petal dress. They gave man nothing at all but stress, causing him to enjoy his paradise all the less. But good old wives, Yadie Ye, Krong Krong Nananyangopong had seen how the once cheerful Oberema had grown lean. It troubled him, it was not a pleasant scene. But Papa knew exactly how to intervene. And so all the winds that be were summoned from the deep and made him powerful blaze around Oberema to sweep, causing him to swoon and fall into deep, sweet sleep, his soul floating back to exhaust to keep. Then, Good old wise of Yadi Krongkrong Nananyangkupong set to work. The look on his face was more like a clack, cat, snap, crack. Men, all his abilities were brought on deck until at last his work was looking speck. Good old wise of Yadi Krongkrong Nananyangkupong had made another being. To say the least, she was worth seeing. For creative, Krongkrong Nananyangkupong made her countenance serene and an empty. All that man had missed was to redeem. Soon Oberima began to and finally awoke. Obviously, he felt that one of his ribs had been broken. He felt so incomplete and began himself in tears to soak, for sadness was the only emotion that his lost rib did evoke. So on this feast of rhymes, Oberima began to and finally awoke. Obviously, he felt one of his ribs had been broken. He began himself in tears to soak, for sadness was the only emotion that his lost rib did evoke. Then. Then, good old wise, Krong Krong Nananyangkupong, the greatest planner of old, caused the sudden weeping of Berima to behold. What he saw left him shaky and cold. Nanahu of Fesia, body nina credo, she was more beautiful than everything he had seen on Countable Folk. Oberima rubbed his eyes and again to see well, until at last his sad countenance fell. He finally had a happy story to tell, and the last thing he could have imagined was hell. This is indeed the bone of my bone. I shall no longer be alone. My lost rib has finally regrown. I tell you, Oberema had flown far beyond the worry zone. So, Krong Krong Nananyangkupong blessed their union. Over all his creation, he gave them dominion. That was the basis of man and nature's communion. But the day was overly colorful in the serpent's opinion. Well, finally, finally, Krong Krong Nananyangkupong, the greatest planner of old, sat and beheld that day was obviously Oberima's best. He called his mate Oba, queen of his terrestrial nest. Good old wise, Oyadiye, Krong Krong Nananyangkupong, greatest planner of all could take his hard and rest. Then he accompanies him. Oh, don't want me. I shall tell you more of this when we meet next. I will share a second piece with you, similarly about love. But you realize that as Ghanaians, we have these distinct qualities. We love to laugh at ourselves. We love to gossip, not in a negative sense. Whichever way we share it, it's still some form of communication and conversation. But one beautiful trend that I find in a typical relationship situation, 
be it citizen reverses their politicians, be it a husband or a wife, is a woman who lost his soul. Even after you have apologized 48 times, in how many months, we still cannot tell. This one is dedicated to all the beautiful Ghanaian women dedicated to Mother Ghana, entitled Oinua. Oinua. You delight me with your childish tantrum. Your mother taught you well, and you have learned well. Anyway, your mother taught you to gossip with the precision of a whisper, and so I want to kiss the color in your mind and rub my lips on the brows of the well. You see, when a beautiful woman serves you food or water, half of her appetite is sated. Into your hinua, each time you have prepared your brodiam piece yet said and you have wet your contumery into pulp with your kobe opoku, red oil and some pear to grace it. The aroma has been enough, but you see, I have always stopped myself with your divine experiments. Senya usrea, na me kuma tomia. Hinua, afi mamen kanu kre. Ma bo mi kuku ti asin ni ma woswa chime metri inti wo. We made Kutru Kua, Mapuma, Ashe, Sumimu, and you could say, Eddie train, I want to train, I want to train, me say, Wampo, Mikokuti, I send you my Wosoni, a pop watch me, Metri, Wo, ye made Dok, Kutru Kua, Mapuma, she could tum de train, I want to train. Oh, you know what? Say, Wunti, my no, a pity, Penis, a mad, as a satassa, my grave fair, or Nanti, dear she, why Jenny Munso? Emotio enemy new of the year by stepping up with GSTV. Things are about to get great, great. Whoa, okay. And that's important because... GSTV, they come give you more of the entertainment you than your family, they like. So first thing, your seatbelt. As GSTV take you go higher with more epic live soccer, exciting local drama, and best kids show. That's a lot. Yo. My people, all you for do be say, eh? Starting from 14th January to 31st March. Upgrade your current DSTV package to the next one, and DSTV will bump you up to the one above that at no extra cost. It be that simple. What? Come on. Oh, exciting. Okay. For example, let's say you have family. All you have to do is pay for compact, and DSTV will give you compact plus at no extra cost. This is a lot. Yeah. Follow us with the hashtag DSTV Step Up for more, or call us on 0302-740-540. Terms and conditions apply. Good day energy drink keeps you going. Available in major supermarkets and shops near you. Excessive drinking can be detrimental to your health. Not recommended for persons under 18 years, lactating mothers, pregnant women, and people sensitive to caffeine. This advert is FDA approved. 
the nominations have been announced for the Entertainment Achievement Awards 2021. The Entertainment Achievement Awards will celebrate the best of the best to vote for your favorites in any of the categories from music to movies, sports, fashion, creative writing, photography, events, media, and comedy. Kindly visit www.entertainmentachievementawards.com forward slash vote and follow the instructions to cast your vote. Use the hashtag EA Awards to follow the conversation and log on to the website www.entertainmentachievementawards.com for more details. The Entertainment Achievement Awards, an institution that will celebrate the creativity, the outstanding personalities, the impact and the influence of Ghana's entertainment and creative arts industry. The Entertainment Achievement Awards is powered by City TV and proudly sponsored by Good Day Energy Drink. Penisi o warning kwan kwan tan sun komo. Ye dino enibre su enya humbrasi mu. Nansu ened ye eye bus yang komo en tio bia jina kunya. Diobenu munsu m fenkra, diobe fesem en sa inkra, yanu munsa ni efaji, yanu munsu, ni e shedam kwama, maybe ya shebre be kukus. She so shen sumwa ibi anu wen hum shebre nansu ti m penin sebi. Femina na sase o mama ko eje bi wo fa se ama me xe won kom we ye gana won kom ebra ye di nfie di osia na ye wi ase se ye kogu they expected us to go on pension at 60 but we proved to them that we still have enough youth in us to keep going so maybe life begins at 60 after all so 60 and how many counts have we had three four are we that young that we are not able to handle our own affairs as in Kruma prophesied. Can we ask ourselves some hard questions? Hard enough that uneasy will become our buttocks once we sit on each of our seats and not leave it only to the head of state. Uneasy lies the head that wears the crown. Everybody wants to shoot the blame. But you see, the higher you go, does it become cooler? Maybe the hotter it becomes because the head of the clan, the head clansman is the one who bears the crown that all of us spent our money to mold and place on his head. Was it for fancy fashion or decoration? No. Obi si, ajun jin wusu miyam. Asa asa mezi debi. Ajun pa de trim, ni mu unye si miyaya, ni mu ju. Now the two swa, wetu miya fa ajun pa. Now sorry ya, wetu mi de tu anamu pa fa kwa mpa swa kupen kwa kupen biyan. Ghana. Dye ni esu ya, dye ni yonu. And so I ask where the fathers have gone. I ask what the children have seen. That a foolish son would want to point to his father's house with a left finger. And a daughter in that wise thinks herself old enough to teach her own mother how to bear children. Ago. Ago. Ago, fiha. And so if only we will tell ourselves the truth. For mind you, this is Africa. This is the center of the world. This is Ghana where everybody knows the truth. Yet a child is not allowed to tell it. Not because it is not the truth, but truth is he is simply a future leader meaning it is not his time to think yet he is yet to follow and when his time is up he will assume the reins of power by then our horses will be running too wild but future leaders simply mean that we owe the responsibility of training the future like a child the way it should go and when we are old enough the future will learn to treat us with some respect the beard the beard is the broom with which the elders gather wisdom. And so I have dared to say many times that our elders raise their beards in the loo due to lose the pigment of youth. But if you can see, this hamatan seems to be greener because the rains are interspersing the hamatan. Even the rains are checking how our manners are fluctuating and are no longer stable. We have holes in our cloth, yet we want to go talk about the holes in someone's roof well when it rains it will come down through the roof and beat them so hard but mind you 
When the sun is up, there will still be holes in your cloth to betray your nakedness. My words might be heavy, but it is because our history is also heavy with pregnancy yet to deliver the futures that we hope to see. When the matter is good, you do not send it through many tongues before it gets to the ear for which it is intended. I am simply a child, still learning the ways of the world and the ropes of my people. I am still a child who would dare not narrate the lessons of history lest I miss some and be told that I had a bad education. But what am I learning? What have I been taught? What do I have to keep and serve to posterity? The national cake? Probably half bitten into? Maybe gone? We'll be left with crumbs to share? Ghana. 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 Ghana, Muntie. Ghana, Sassi, Uni, or Mamma, Wager, be off us here. Or can no credit at the chair. Share me a piece of impenisem, some young consem, Missem, Missachini, went to me and found son to me, Sayamua. Femobo, Nami Musa, who your Mamma Ghana this year. If you are proud of who you are. Of whom? Then let us not burn home and engrave our names in the ashes, not forgetting that this is the place where the four winds meet to share gossip with earth, sea, and sky, and soon our names will be off. And so please, let us not hell insults at the stranger whose cat calls coincided with our conversations. And as I say, Mama these are just random thoughts I thought to have with you in conversation while Hashmullah was playing the strings. Jifa was on my left. And I still want that amputee in Shio. And then all of us can have this beautiful communion of ourselves. A shadows will find their places on the walls. Ghana Dishi. Let me clap for myself. Ah. <laughs> always a pleasure to have you with Thank us. Thank you, Jay. It's a pleasure to be here. What would you like to drink? Um, we have a sauna. We have lamujin. When I'm done. Okay. You don't want to drink now? We have a cocktail of different things. What have you been up to? A lot of poetry unusual. Okay. Yes. I feel the season is good for us to lie low, reflect, mm -hmm. meditate, and lay a lot of pipes aside the other ones which are the pipelines which we are waiting to unclog. We are laying new ones mm -hmm. so that by the time COVID is gone, a lot of oh, beautiful this thing, your mic, music, sorry. a lot of <laughs> beautiful poetry, a lot of beautiful art can come through it. Mm -hmm. so forget I have been the mic busy. Come close. Oh, come, come okay. Close. So talk. I can talk yes, to you. Can talk. <laughs> I've been busy creating a lot of beautiful things, mm -hmm. putting together a, re a rebirth. Let me call it a rebirth of the mental picture series. We used to have the mental yeah. picture series years ago. Yeah. It's coming back. Okay. And so Ashmula, myself, our manager, and the rest of the team, Celsi, we've been trying to put it together and bring back the mental picture series. How important is it now more than ever? How important is it now more than ever? This will be the fifth edition mm -hmm. and it's dubbed Confluence. Okay. And so all the things we've worked for, somebody says consolidating our gains. This mm -hmm. is not political <laughs> talk. Everything coming together. Yeah. Confluence. Flu belongs to mother. I feel it's a rebirth, a reinvigoration of spoken word, of poetry, of all our art forms, the things that we do. Look, we do not have to allow other people to celebrate us. If we leave it to them, yeah. the time will never be right with them. So it's time for us as artists to still create our own platforms and share with other artists. And we have a beautiful communion of ourselves. Yeah. Two. The creative art economy, I've always said, is one of the most untapped resources that we have as a nation in Ghana. And this is still in our bid to help identify young literary talent, groom it, and also bridge the gap between the generations using art. Okay. You realize that art, aside soccer, aside politics, art is one of the forms that brings all of us together. together. So yeah. that right there, even in the stadium, we are having jama. Mm -hmm. Jama is one, it's, 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 art. it's art. In our political circles, we're having jama. Yeah. In our political circles, we're having poetry. In our political circles, we have commentary. Mm -hmm. All these things are beautiful art forms. You don't go to political rallies sabbatically in your ideal state of nature. Mm -hmm. You come there clothed in beautiful African fashion. I love you. Thank you very much. I'm fit by the This can take. It was the other one Nkrumah was about to wear on the night he declared independence. He left it for me because he knew in 2021 20, <laughs> I would have to wear it, be on City TV and admonish all <laughs> Ghanaians to give our very best to ensure that Ghana survives. It's critical to us at this point in time. Tomorrow we turn 64. Tomorrow we turn 64. What does it mean to you? And 
how more, how much more do we need to do to do we need to do uplift the and so arts. a man was caught for over speed, allegedly over speeding the speed limit was 70 the man was at 100 so he told the police of our chief you know what uh, store the 70 at least that's my speed limit i've done it the 30 is still under speeding <laughs> so really retirement was supposed to be 60 but uh, we've done 60 and 4, so at 4, we're still very young. We've yeah. proven to them that probably life begins at 60. Look, you can't compare us to anybody. We can only be ourselves. Yeah. We should have our organic growth. Let's make our mistakes. Let's learn from it. Mm -hmm. But please, when the truth is the truth, allow anybody to tell it, whether it's a child or an adult. Yeah. When somebody does a wrong thing, deserves a spanking, let us spank him. When we are done, it stays in our circles. Yeah. Because just as the cock that crows to wake up, the whole neighborhood belongs to one household. There's a proverb in Akan that says, we'll be on track on our new war. And so we'll be our best for money. Nobody wants to give birth to a stubborn child. Yet everybody will send this child on an errand. Yeah. And so when this child is, it's still the responsibility of the whole community. We all go out to vote for our leaders. Mm -hmm. When they go wrong, what do we do? Yeah. We owe the responsibility. Nana Sase. Yes, Jifa. Thank you. My pleasure for being to be authentically here. Thank you. Thank you so much. And giving this gift of yours to us I mean, and the whole world. Thank you so much. Can I say really thank you to a few people? Oh, yes. Feel free. Shout out. Shout Let them all out. Let me say thank you to... Hashmila. Please let's not for Kofi here. Hashmila. Kofi has done Where do we follow him on social media as well? At hash da celibate. Yes. At hash da celibate, please. Cel celibate. Hash da celibate. Yeah. Ah, okay, celibate. Okay. Thank you very much. <laughs> I'd like to say... <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Okay. It's um, Mujiza Kofi Wee Okay, Mujiza Kofi Wee Okay, yes, the I'd other like people you want to shout thank out. Thank you to Selassie Daphne. Okay. She's been our stage manager for, our wow. stage director for for years, okay. ever, even before anybody got to know of us. Wow. I'd like to say thank that you to some sort of yes, the Pram Pram Fisherman, Annie Osabute. Yeah. Annie has been in the background with us. Nana mm -hmm. And our manager now, Miss Sally Tope. Wow. Sally, wherever you are, God bless you. It takes Beautiful. A village. Literally takes Look, a we can't call all the names, so yeah. thank you to everybody. But we have to follow you on social media, so share your social media with us. Asase Nana. Asase Nana. Charlie, if you are in doubt, just go on Google, put in Nana Asase. And Whatever I'm you find me. Thank you, Nana Asase. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you, Apple, for, for staying. We have a lot more for you, okay? It's a heritage month. A lot of you have been sending in messages. Keep them coming. The hashtag is Breakfast Daily, and our WhatsApp line is 0550 What does this beautiful month mean to you, especially since we will turn 64 tomorrow? Don't go anywhere. Breakfast today will be right back.